All right, so we're starting with pull-ups, wide grip, two sets of wide grip pull-ups to failure. Now, if you can't lift your own body weight, there's always assisted machines at LA Fitness. Yes, the machine trains at LA Fitness. South Elgin. No, this isn't the LA Fitness in Arkansas. They all look the same. It's called a chain. Yo, so, wide grip is generally harder than close grip. So what we're gonna do now is close grip to failure. Two sets of each to failure. That means when you can't pull your fat ass up anymore. So I learned these from man Josh. 135 overhand, 135 underhand. 185 overhand, 185 underhand. 225 overhand, 225 underhand. <laughs> Thing is you're doing six total sets, but underhand you tend to be able to get more weight. It also targets more, targets more of your lats. Everybody always asks me overhand or underhand. Fuck it, go both ways. Yeah, so we're gonna do overhand. First set, first two sets are 15 reps, then 12 reps for the second two. Then for this one, we're gonna do 10. You should have told me that before I got my sets. <laughs> I did tell you that, just don't listen. <laughs> All right, check it out. So. This is a machine, bro. This is a, a hammer strength, high row machine. Now what we're gonna do here is just three straight sets. I grab it wider, cause I'm wider. The narrow grip tends to bring it down to here. For me, I want it here. Um, basically three sets. I don't know, six to 15 reps. That's what I do. <laughs> Got the game train. One plane ain't enough. One plane ain't a dime. There you go. See, now Katie can grab it closer because she doesn't have lat issues. I have lat issues. Good. Alright, so. We're gonna go back to a compound move, T-bar rows. One warm up set with three plates, and we're gonna monster drop set with five, four, three, two, one plates. Um, last time I did these, boosts, said I was standing upright. I'm getting good contraction in my back, it's how I feel best. And um, honestly, if you wanna bend over more, go ahead. That's how I fucking do them. I'm obviously, my back's probably bigger than yours. So I'm gonna do them this way, all right? This is what feels best for me, based on my overall structure. And it's a T-bar row, not a bent over row. Some people just like to bend over more. Yeah, these fucking controls. Dumbbell variation of the pullover. This works, believe it or not, a lot of core because look, you got to keep your core tense. And we actually did core the other day. I know Katie did it at Stu's. I'm feeling this a lot in my core. Also brings in your chest to play and all that. The dumbbell variation is a really good variation of it. They have machines and everything, but 
I don't know, man. I think I might go back to the yeah. dumbbell. I like it as an overall core movement now. I didn't even realize that. How much of the core it works. That's not actually like thought. Holy fuck, this work is a core. A lot of people are looking for new back exercise. This is one I would ask how I put all the size on my back between the two two years since I turned pro and I'm gonna show you this is the uh, the boxer twerk. So you come like this. <laughs> You gotta, you gotta, first make your knees touch your elbow. <laughs> and then you're stuck. <laughs> and then you gotta get the roots out. You gotta, you gotta get the full motion. So you bend over, make your knees touch your elbow. And then you do a row while you're doing it. That way you bring in all parts. That, you that want mass gains, back gains like the machine? That is the secret. The Bosu ball twerk. Get one. You saw it first here on Tiger Fitness. Tiger Fitness is gonna carry him now. <laughs> now we're being serious, okay? I get asked a lot, you know, I know I have so many videos that can't expect to see them all. This is on my core ab building, whatever the fuck I called it, series of playlists. But what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna demonstrate how to do this and I'll film Katie's set. So this is a one arm, this is a one arm, one leg row. So what we're gonna do, grab something right in front of this, okay? Look at this decrepit machine, okay? Line up, hand, foot, everything straight. Boom. Leg and pull up. So everything's straight. Right? The amount of force you have on your core is awesome. Try it out. Demonstrated like a swan. It's like a ballet dance. A swan? No, like a, a flamingo. Whatever. Anyway, three sets, ten reps each side.